What's going on, everybody? So we had O'Reilly's here. Just went in there and got a couple things. Gonna be working on my 92 with the 5.3 today. Try to go ahead and try to get it finished up this month, hopefully. But I got just some connectors so I can wire up the OBD port. So I can try to get a tune put on it. And uh, I got a O2 sensor bong here. I'm gonna weld in there. The way the O2 sensor bong on my headers is now, when I try to screw it in, it basically goes right into the side of the transmission. There ain't enough room to get it in there. So I'm gonna drill a hole and weld this one in there. And that way I can put the O2 sensor straight in from the top. I'll have plenty of room. So I gotta run by Walmart and get a couple of odd and end things. And then go get started. All right, see if it'll start. We need to pull it over there on some ramps. I think it just ran out of gas as soon as I got it pulled up on the ramp. Tried to rev it up a few times and it just cut out. I reckon I'll let it cool off for a second and then I'll start getting that driver's side header off. So, as you can see, the way it is now, it goes right in the side of the transmission. And I even tried to loosen the header up and pull it out some and then screw it in and then bolt the header back up tight. But that didn't work either. As you can see, there's plenty of room right there up top. So I'm gonna put the O2 bong right there. Right up top there somewhere. All right, took a little persuasion, but I got her off. Got her hole drilled. Pretty much perfect size. Get that cleaned up. Weld this on there. And then find something to plug that one off with and stick it back on there. Alright, there we go. It's a done deal. Just weld it in there. Not the prettiest looking ever, but it's solid. It ain't gonna be leaking or coming out, anything like that. And then where the old one was, I just cut a bolt off because I didn't have a, one big enough to screw down in there. So I just cut a bolt head off. And as you can see, welded it off. It's the next evening here. Got dark on yesterday. I didn't feel like trying to fool with all that crap in the dark. But uh, finally got it all back together had her bolted up exhaust bolted back up i reckon now i'm gonna put some gas in it i gotta air that tire up on their pasture side over there's flat and i'm gonna back it off the ramps here and uh i guess i'm gonna start wiring up my obd port i way a bit of hook a laptop to this rig and hopefully start tuning on it here soon port here uh, from what i've read online there's four wires you need you got a power wire that's constant 12 volts and you got your wire that goes to the computer ecm and then you got two ground wires uh from what i read one ground wires for certain years another ground is for other years but i'm just gonna ground them both out that way i ain't got to worry about trying to figure out which is which and then uh, that's pretty much it 
Alright, so I got my plug here off my computer so I can make sure I got the right wire. And I looked online and what I found is pin number 58. It's that one right there, I do believe. But it's this it's this green wire right here. So what I'm gonna do is peel some of this tape back, try to trace that wire down as far as I can. And then uh basically all wired into this. I think it goes like this, yeah. It'll wire into this one. It'll be number 16. That's your serial data wire, I think is what it's called. And then you got the two grounds. I'll ground them out. And then the other one, just constant 12 volt. Alright, so got that done. It's wired up. I just set it right there for now. I'll probably move it if I ever get to the get around to doing the wire harness and making it all pretty and all that good stuff but a couple more things accomplished a little bit closer to finally being able to get it tuned basically ready now all i got to do really is wire up some fans we'll put some fans on it and wire them up i mean i need to figure out something with an intake but basically just wire up some fans for now and go over a few things it'll be ready to tune and then after I get it tuned, then I'll try to make everything nicer and prettier and all that good stuff. But that's going to be the end of this one for now. So like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more. Later.